considered a standalone pedal or desktop synth with four oscillators slash voices, two on each side with separate LFO controls for each pair. This is the on and off switch. This is the volume knob. With all switches down, it engages oscillator number one. Turning it to the right makes the pitch go down. Turning it to the left makes the pitch go up. This is the LFO. With it all the way down, it's disengaged, but once you turn it to the right, it changes the pitch. And then you have the LFO rate and the indicator of how fast you're going. And then you have the LFO square wave or sine wave. Right now we're on a square wave. Once you flip it up, it'll be into a sine wave. Square wave. Turn the LFO all the way down and flip this switch to activate oscillator number two. So oscillator number two and oscillator number one are running. So now if you turn this to the left, the pitch will go down. Turn it to the right, the pitch will go up. You can make cool harmonies. When you flip the switch up, it turns this into a frequency sweep. And we'll sweep the frequency of this oscillator and the LFO. Turn this switch down and just the LFO is left. Okay, and these are both frequency sweeps for the LFO. Turn the LFO all the way down. Turn this to 12 o'clock, and this to 12 o'clock, and it's the silent patch. So this switch won't be affected unless the LFO is active. All right? Now, check out the other side. It's the exact same, but mirrored. So it's on the silent patch right now. So center oscillator. Both oscillators together. Frequency sweep. Square wave, sine wave for the LFO. Speed for the LFO. And the indicator. Okay, 
So this one up here is the resonance knob. And then these two over here are the coarse and fine filters. The coarse filter, all the way up. And then you go underwater as you keep going the other way. All right, the fine filter works well with the coarse filter. So if we turn all of this all the way up. We can fully open up the pedal that way. The through input allows any instrument to run separately from the Drone King. So if you put any effects before the Drone King, they'll run separately and not affect the Drone King at all. The Drone King says,